So, the rocks are classified into three types we saw that is igneous, igneous are of two types extrusive, intrusive. This intrusive is of two types plutonic and high pebbles. Now, second rock is sedimentary. This is first igneous and now sedimentary. Uh, what are the uh, characteristics of sedimentary rocks I told you? Uh, it is having four layers, very good. Uh, then many layers are there, okay. First one and second one, uh, yes very good. It is soft in nature, uh, okay. Third one, uh, yes it contains fossils, uh, very good. Okay, fourth one, yes very good. It is not crystalline, understand? Now, we are going to see about the types of sedimentary rocks. There are three types of sedimentary rocks. They are organic, then mechanical and the third one chemical. There are three types of sedimentary rocks. What are they? Organic, mechanical and chemical. In the organic uh, sedimentary rocks, uh, it is in a contains fossils, the decayed materials. I told you, no. Mara, chedi, kodi, trees, then animals, the decayed materials. Apdi sedimentai, adalandu uruvagarana, organic. Organic sedimentary rocks. In the organic sedimentary rocks, example, it contains fossils, fossils, example in a chalk, chalk, talc, chalk, talc and dolomite, dolomite, then limestone, they are the example of organic sedimentary rock. Mechanical sedimentary rock, Adana due to the disintegration of igneous and metamorphic rock. Uh, mechanical, mechanical reaction, so rola, mechanical due to the igneous rocks sedimenta marumbodu igneous rocks ay nama paathom and the igneous rocks ay settle down panni adu sedimenta marumbodu it is in a called as mechanical sedimentary rocks understand this mechanical sedimentary rocks aduke example enna enna paakalam appdin sonna it is um, uh, what sandstone shale and clay they are the examples of mechanical sedimentary rocks. And chemical sedimentary rocks are preparation from the minerals. Minerals are the chemical sedimentary rocks from the minerals. They are uh, um, what we can say example of this uh, chemical is gypsum. Example. Example of chemical rocks is gypsum we can say that is it contain it is uh, contains of evaporation and uh, precipitation because of the uh, rocks which are uh, due to the evaporation due to the precipitation the rocks will be changed so it is called as chemical chemical reaction so chemical example minerals and the rocks that is the example is gypsum. 
So, what are the types of uh, sedimentary rocks? There are three types of sedimentary rocks. They are organic sedimentary rocks, mechanical sedimentary rocks and chemical sedimentary rocks. Organic sedimentary rocks, it contains fossils, fossil, understand? So, for that examples are chalk, talc, dolomite and limestone. And the second one is mechanical sedimentary rock. Mechanical means mechanically it changed. The uh, igneous rocks and metamorphic rock, it uh, some years passed away. It will end up because of the sediment. Settle down, path all the rivers lala, and the waterfalls, rivers lala, and the sediment akkadu. Appadi sediment akkadu lande uruvagarada, they are called as uh, mechanical sedimentary rocks. That is example only, sandstone, shale and clay. And the third one is chemical sedimentary rock. Chemical sedimentary rock, it is uh, changing of the minerals which contains Understand because of the evaporation, precipitation, rainfall, sunlight, heat, pressure, all these. Understand? So, it chemi because of the chemical reaction. Adhik example is gypsum. Okay. Now, we will pass on to the third one metamorphic rock. The third rock is metamorphic rock. Where, where shall I write? Shall I write here the rocks? Third one. Third one is metamorphic rock. Here, meta and mafa means shape. Understand? Changes. Metamorphic. Meta means meta and morphic. Other metamorphic. Meta means change. And morphic means shape. So, it is because of the changes, it is contains some of the shape. So, it is called as together metamorphic rocks. Okay. Now, now what are the metamorphic rocks? We can say there are two type of metamorphic rocks. Here, metamorphic rocks are of two types. One is thermal metamorphic and dynamic. Thermal and another one is dynamic. Here, because of the uh, rainfall, high pressure, uh, then high temperature, then cooling of the air, the atmosphere, understand? So, all these together, the, uh, it, it changed the igneous rocks and sedimentary rocks, uh, it changed the shape of the rocks. The igneous rocks are yon, sedimentary rocks are yon, it changes the characteristics of igneous rocks and sedimentary rocks. The igneous rocks are yon, molten magma, volcanic eruption, sedimentary rocks are yon, settle down, the rivers and the uh, water, waterfalls, settle down, sedimentary. So, this is character the temperature, uh, then the pressure, rainfall, atmosphere, erosion. Understand? So, all these because of the changes of the earth, the nature, the natural changes of the earth rotation, the movement, the igneous and sedimentary rock, it will change. Meta, meta means change, the shape, morphic. And that is called as metamorphic rock. Like that, like this type only, the metamorphic rocks are formed. Understand? And we can uh, have two types in metamorphic rocks. What are they? Thermal metamorphic rock and dynamic type. Thermal type and dynamic type. In the thermal type, because of the temperature of the earth, it will be easy for you. Understand, in the rocks, metamorphic rocks, two important elements we need. What are they? Temperature and pressure. So, temperature, thermal. Thermal metamorphic, what we need? Temperature. So, because of temperature, it will occur. 
because of the temperature the process is the rock of the process is called high temperature it is called as thermal metamorphism because of the pressure another one is pressure because of the high pressure because of the high pressure the um, classification is called as dynamic temperature high temperature nala uruvagirathu that is called as thermal tt temperature thermal ena easier irukum ungalku eppadi edu uruvagudhu nu solittu ungalku in one words la then short answers la and in distinguish la and give reason many exercises are there i don't know in which they will ask you okay so uh, this thermal means tt ngaba vechukonga thermal uh, this rocks are uh, uh, eppadi varudhu appdi ketta because of the high temperature understand and uh, dynamic rocks are formed by the high pressure of pressure of the earth so these are the two types of uh, metamorphic rock now these forms of the metamorphic rock i already i told you this metamorphic rocks change meta change morphic shape so in the igneous rocks change aagi enna vaagudhu in the sedimentary rock change aagi enna va maarudhu abindrada now we'll see have you uh, heard about taj mahal have you seen taj mahal abbi nerla poi in person ah ninga paakala na kuda you can see in the television in many pictures taj mahal is one of the wonders of the world you all know the taj mahal end the rock la built panirukanga na metamorphic rock that is marble full ah shah jahan avanga wife kaga katnaaru la la yes very good taj mahal is one of the wonders of the world ulaga adisayam adhula adu onnu taj mahal is one of the wonders of the world it is fully constructed with marble this marble is belong to metamorphic rock can you able to follow ipo ungalku aacharyam mark illa oh nam metamorphic rock pathi padikiram taj mahal namakku theriyum so in the metamorphic rock in the marble vachu da full ah taj mahal build panirukanga நீங்க பெருசாக ஆன உடனே யூ ஆஸ்க் யூ பேரண்ட் டு டேக் யூ டு தாஜ்மஹால் தாஜ்மஹால் வாழ்க்கையில் ஒரு தடவையாவது போய் பார்த்துருங்க ஓகே இட் இஸ் அ வெரி பியூட்டிஃபுல் பில்டிங் அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்ட் சச் அ பியூட்டிஃபுல் பில்டிங் இட் இஸ் ஒன் ஆஃப் த ஒண்டர்ஸ் ஆஃப் த வேர்ல்டு இட் இஸ் மேட் அப் ஆஃப் மெட்டமாஃபிக் ராக் அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்ட் ஓகே ஐ டோல் யூ தென் தேஞ்சஸ் த மெட்டமாஃபிக் ராக்ஸ் ஹவு இட் ஃபார்ம்ட் ஐ டோல் யூ ஃப்ரம் த இக்னேயர்ஸ் அண்ட் செடிமெண்ட்ரி ராக்ஸ் இட் சேஞ்சஸ் ஓகே ஃப்ரம் இக்னேயர்ஸ் எப்படி மாறுது இக்னேயர்ஸ் ராக்ஸில் எப்படி எதுலேருந்து எது மாறுது அப்படின்னு சொன்னால் ஃப்ரம் த இக்னேயர்ஸ் இங்கே போட்டிருக்கேன் பாருங்கள் இந்த இக்னேயர்ஸ் அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்ட் கிரானைட் இன்டு இந்த புக் யூ கேன் சி சில்ட்ரன் கிரானைட் இன்டு நீஸ் கிரானைட் எக்ஸாம்பிள்ஸ் அண்ட் பாசால்ட் இன்டு ஸ்லேட் basalt into slate the granite enna va maaruma granite granite indrathu it is a igneous rocks neese indrathu metamorphic rock granite enna va maariduda metamorphic la varumbodhu pala aayiram varshangalukku peragu neese a maarudhu okay adhe mari basalt it is a metamorphic rock extrusive rock adhu enna va maarudhu slate can you able to follow okay in sedimentary rock la enna va maarudun paakala in the sedimentary rock i told you the example sandstone this sandstone changes into sandstone changes into quartz sandstone changes into quartz and shale changes into slate இங்கே போட்டிருக்கல சாண்ட்ஸ்டோன் ஷேல் தே ஆர் வாட் ராக் செடிமெண்ட்ரி ராக்ஸ் வெரி குட் தி சாண்ட்ஸ்டோன் செடிமெண்ட்ரி ராக் இன் சேஞ்ச் இன் டு குவாட்ஸ் குவாட்ஸ் இஸ் அ மெட்டமாஃபிக் ராக் அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்ட் அண்ட் ஷேல் இட் இஸ் ஆல்சோ செடிமெண்ட்ரி ராக் அது என்னவா மாறுது ஸ்லேட் மெட்டமாஃபிக் ராக் ஓகே நவ் 
will pass on to the characteristics of metamorphic rock. இது இதோட என்ன character அப்படின் பார்க்கலாம் அப்படின் சொன்னா, it is mostly the character of metamorphic rock is crystalline. See all of you, crystalline, பல பல பார்க்கும் கொண்டு சொல்கிறோம் அல்ல, it is shining crystalline, understand? Another one is it is uh, alternate bands of light and dark minerals. It is it contain uh, light as well as dark minerals. Minerals. Okay, children. So these are all about rocks. What are the types of rocks I told you? Uh, igneous rocks, sedimentary rocks, and metamorphic rock. Now, we saw about that. Now, we will pass on to the rock cycle. What is a rock cycle? In short answer, they will ask you children, rock cycle. What are the three types of uh, rocks I told you? I taught you? Yes, very good. Igneous rocks, sedimentary rocks, uh, metamorphic rock. Have you understand children? Don't forget. 